Okay, now we're gonna trigger some melodic video clips to go with the shapes that we have on the, the kit. Um, so we have the shape visuals still in there, and now I've grabbed some vocal vids uh, from Ali Rockberger, who is part of Mr. Barrington with myself and Owen Biddle. And we use these vocals here as sort of more rubato and airy, just floating over the groove. So the timing of them doesn't have to be perfectly intact. It's just that the pitches highlight the harmonic structure of the song. So uh, listen for that and see how the visuals interact with the shapes. And they do respond to dynamic input from the drums. So as I strike harder, you'll see things change. And uh, yeah, just have a look. from your brain to your hands, through the stick to the drum. From your brain to your hands, to the drum from your brain to your hands from your from your from your to the stick to the brain from to drum 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 In that clip I had sampled someone you may be familiar with and what I wanted to do with that is not only trigger spoken word phrases over a chord palette but I wanted to loop the video and I have loopers set up in a way that don't give me the same result every time. And the reason why I like this is because it enters the unknown and in a way that I wouldn't be able to uh, conjure up on my own. It sort of spits something out that at times is sometimes I love it, sometimes I like it, and I feed off of it in either event. And it's something that keeps things fresh within the same arrangement, much in the same way you're playing with other musicians and they'll throw something in that you didn't expect them to throw in. I look at this as a musician, even though it's computer generated, but it's given me something to work off of in a way that I would never uh, have if I didn't have something of a random surprise. So that's what you're seeing in that clip. From your brain to your hands, through the stick to the drum. This is the root of your musical energy. Use it well, use it thoughtfully, use it musically. From your brain to your hands, through the stick to the drum. 
This is the root of your musical energy. Use it well. Use it thoughtfully. Use it musically. From the brain to your hands, through the stick to the bone. This is the root of your musical energy. From your brain to your hands, through the stick to the bone. This is the root of your musical energy. From your brain to your hands, through the stick to the bone. This is the root of your musical energy. Use it well. Use it thoughtfully. Use it musically. Okay, I figured I'd wrap up the show with a little bit more Vic. This time, I pre-pitched some of his vocals to lay over the chord changes properly, so we had that. But then we also introduced vocoding, and the vocoding allows his voice to mimic the movement of the chord changes. Either he can sing in chords, I mean, single lines from the chords if you want, so you can mess around and pitch things on the fly. So you can get a lot of mileage out of this one. In closing, I wanna just say that it's been many years in the making trying to fulfill this vision. And while I know that I've made strides, I also know that I've only scratched the surface. There are easier musical paths one can choose, but throughout my career, I've found that a genuine, passionate commitment to one's vision is what defines a true artist. And I encourage all of you to dig deep in your own musical endeavors. I know Vic, for one, would be proud. Until next time, thanks for watching.